of the moment. Heat of the moment. Guys, you gotta hear this tape that Jeff Schwartz made me. He like rambles on about how special I am. Such a dork. Enough. What? All year you've been saying you don't like the guy. That's because I don't. What? But I don't. I don't like Jeff Schwartz. It's crazy how sometimes your life can change in a flash, and all the things you were blind to or refused to admit are suddenly staring you right in the face. Damn it, I like stupid Jeff Schwartz. And just like that, everything suddenly falls into place. Jeff, can we... Come on, sweetie. It's like fate, right? To be clear, we're all just friends here, right? Just Amigos! Stop saying anything in me and go home! Look, if a guy like Christian Slater walks through that door, I promise you I will go with him to homecoming. Christian Slater, huh? You want the coolest guy in the world? You got him. Greetings and salutations. Okay, look, I, I just, I think you're great. Okay, I have since like second grade. Mm, Jeff, this was sweet, but I have a pretty firm no moron policy. You're the guy who told me to give the morons a chance. But I meant other morons. What other morons? Nice morons. Morons like that Jeff kid. Oh man, that was so sweet of me, huh? So if it's looking like you're free Saturday night, then... I'm not going to the dance, Jeff. Not with anybody. Just give people a chance. Don't be a moron. Greetings and salutations. Her so much. And I want to date with Erica. Check mine out. No, take it off. Hey, Erica, look what I can do. You guys, I thought I could do this to impress Erica, but I just, I can't. I, I get wicked stage fright. It's okay, she's a groupie. I can't do this, Erica. Look away! Hi, Erica. You called and I came right away. Isn't that nice of me? 100? Who knows? Maybe today your secret admirer will reveal himself and you realize that love is under your nose the whole time. I'm so close. Or you kiss him because you realize you're soulmates. Are we talking about us? There isn't an us. Now you have to just sit back and watch me date a parade of hot ladies knowing in your heart that you missed out. I give up, okay? I made a deal with myself. If I couldn't win you over by Valentine's Day, then it was time to move on. There's this girl I like, but she won't give me the time of day. This girl, who's clearly me, just wants to be friends. My heart hurts, but I appreciate the open communication and it only makes me like you more. Hey, Erica, check me out. I'm tough and sexy. Hey, pretty, pretty. I will dedicate my life to becoming your own personal Swayze. Dance is back on. That means I can still spice you. Operation Dance My Way into Erica's Heart is a go. I love sharing secrets with you. Now I Just like you practice, dude. You can do this. No, I never felt like this before. Oh, I just blew it. Now I have the time of my life. No, I never like this people yes I swear 
Back off my girl. Not your girl. I love you, Erica. You will be. And that excitable boy who so clearly loves you. Who is it? I'll fight him. Battle of the bands. Who's in? Me. I'll literally do whatever you want. Not you. I love you, Erica. Hey, Erica. You want to sign my yearbook? I saved you precious real estate right next to my face. Hi. Have a summer. Did you mean like good summer or, or bitchin' summer or, or sexy summer? Summer. Dude, you gotta let this go. Yeah, don't be such a ducky. Such a what? Ducky! The twerpy, lovesick best friend who never gets Molly Ringwald. My Nana says that I look like handsome renegade Donnie Wahlberg. <gasps> Your Nana's so sweet, but wrong. Hey, why are you going to the bathroom with a shovel? Oh, is this a lady thing? No. You gotta dig up this stupid time capsule. Oh no. I'm bowling to I stashed a tape professing my love to Erica in that time capsule so that our kids could hear it 30 years from now. Nice move, Ducky. I'm not Ducky, it's romantic. I even serenade her with the power ballad Heat of the Moment by Asia. It's classic Ducky, bro. Yeah. Oh, you're right. I gotta get that tape back. Stop! You can't dig that up! I never meant to be so bad to you. Wait, wait, wait! I'll help so I can open it first! One thing I said that I would never do. Just don't worry, I'm gonna flood you with my body! Everything in the time capsule was completely ruined. Yes! Oh, everything except this one thing. No! We should throw that away just to be fair. Oh, I think this is for you. Or future wife Erica Schwartz love your future hubby? Really, dude? Jeff, for the millionth time, I don't like you that way. Not now, not in the future, not ever. Oh, I really am the guy. The dork from Pretty in Pink? Yes, that's a great example. That's exactly who you are. I don't have time for any drama. Speaking of drama, what about Josh Schwartz? Who cares about that tool? I mean, sure, he loved me his whole life and I foolishly blew him off. But now Jeff's with Abby, which is great. Crap, did they come? You can't concern yourself with bigger things. You catch a pull and ride the dragon. I officially give up because I suck at love and I'm going to die alone! I tried to convince myself I don't care about Jeff and Evie, but every day I'll be reminded that I blew it. Where you been all week? Lay low, but I'm back. Bill, would you rather put your heart in the hands of a proven love champion or risk everything with someone whose romantic record is a little spotty? Hey, my record is not spotty, and I'm like the best ever at love. You only like Jeff after he wanted nothing to do with you. Set up straight. Yes, my love. Please, I need to find someone. Erica? I need to find Bill someone. It's how I'm going to prove that I'm good at this. We all get one true love. And she was mine. There is no way you only get one soulmate in life because he's in love with someone else and then I'm going to be alone forever and I'm not going to let that happen to you, Bill. Just want to make sure that I don't miss my one chance to have a happy life with Jeff. I don't know who this Jeff guy is, but I think he may have dodged him. You swore you'd never look in my Yanti decks. You were right. I'm like really bad at love. Trust me, you're not. I just wish I didn't blow it with Jeff. It really hurts, you know? It just... It hurts. You'll find the right guy when the timing is right. I just know it. Every Yenta has a Rolodex filled with perfect matches for everyone they know. His name's Jordan Wahlberg, and he just transferred to Villanova. You are so lucky. But not as lucky as finding a guy like my Jeffy. Yeah, I can do this.
We are just so happy that you have finally, finally found someone, Erica. What about you, Jeff? Are you happy for me or is it more complicated than that? What? Huh? Nothing. Come on, Erica, of all people, wouldn't need to make up a boyfriend. Thank you, Jeff. I mean, I've never even seen the Brady Bunch. Oh, you clearly just referenced the thing you said you didn't know, so now I feel sad for you. Well, I guess we'll believe it if and when we meet him. You know, my Nana says that sometimes wishing makes it so. Your pity makes it worse. Agreed. Evie outed me, and everyone thinks I'm a total joke. Anything I can do? At this point... There's nothing anybody can do. Erica! He's real? Sorry. Jordan Wahlberg, who is clearly very real. I told you we're over. He's taking it hard. Looks like it. Are you okay? Yeah. He just wasn't the one. You and Jeff, that's the real deal. Me and Evie came up with the perfect couple's costume. I'm going to be Seymour from Little Shop of Horrors. And I'll be Audrey, too, the man-eating plant. Lainey's hot cousin, Nate, he did say you're in a very serious relationship. It's not that serious. I mean, we could break up any time, so I can date other people. You have trouble committing? Nope. I'm very open to that, just with the right person, which it's not right now. Are you okay, Jeff? Oh my gosh, did you break up? No, Abby can't go to the Halloween dance. Why don't you two do a couple's costume together? Yes! Thought you had a date. No, his grandma's sick. I'm going to make a Broadway quality costume with my own two hands. You're back! No, we're not going to the dance together. I'll go with my girlfriend, but see you there? For sure! You had your chance last year. Oh, Evie, sure you're smart and confident, but it won't be enough. Only the woman with the upper hand does that. We both know who that is. This is a fight you can't win, Missy. Because I already won. You're doing a couple's costume with your sister. Is he on the dance floor? For sure. Erica's date is her brother. That is rough. I can always cheer her up. Well, maybe there's someone else who can. Hey. Barry said you could use a friend. And Seymour always knows how to cheer up his Audrey, right? Not this time. Come on, I've known you since, like, kindergarten. There's always one thing that can cheer you up no matter what. I'm not singing, Jeff. That's okay. I'll start. What, you think I won't? I will. I'm not afraid. Lift up your head, wash off your mascara. You're really doing this, huh? Here, take my Kleenex, wipe that lipstick away. Oh, no. Show me your face, clean as the morning. I know things were bad, but now they're okay. Come on, I know you want to sing, I can see it. Suddenly Seymour is standing beside you. Don't leave me hanging. together now suddenly Seymour is here to provide you with sweet understanding Seymour's your friend thanks for being such a good friend always What you doing? Just noodling on a new song. Oh, uh, yeah? What's it about? A boy who can't see what's right in front of him. I'm actually jealous of my brother and his girlfriend. This is Nulo. Hey, Erica. Jeff! Wow, this is so thoughtful. He really is. Aren't I the luckiest? Yes, you are. Because you're dating, so obviously the wonderful bear is for you. We want the old Erica back. You know, you're so confident and talented. I miss your fire and your passion. You're weak and sad and boy crazy. Erica? Are you okay? This is the second time I've seen this movie today, so no. Jeff to the rescue. I guess I'm just not the girl that I used to be. Erica's heartbroken because she's in love with a boy who's not interested in her anymore. You've been in love with Erica for a long time? Like forever. She finally loves you back. 
Erica Goldberg, this is for you. Erica, you like that guy? Nope, he's very confused. Not confused. Her dad specifically told me she was secretly in love with me, but could never admit it. Because of you, I got serenaded in front of the whole school. You don't have to thank me. It was the wrong boy. I told Dave Kim that you loved him, when it's really Jeff Schwartz who you love. I didn't hear all that. I'm, I'm just going to run away for an unrelated reason. I've liked Erica forever, but I'm with Evie now. All that matters is that you're honest and listen to your heart. We gotta talk. If it's about what my dad said, we really don't. I really think we should. He's like, dead wrong. That's a relief, because I'm with Evie now and we're really happy. And I'm happy for you guys. Can we talk? You know about that thing that happened between us with our lips and stuff? Yeah, it was a stupid one-time mistake that we've made every day for the last three weeks. This has to stop! Does it? I don't know! It does. Does it though? It doesn't! And you know why? I'm gonna break up with Evie today. I think something's going on between me and Jeffrey. Jeffrey, the Toys R Us giraffe? Life will move on. Erica, you told her about us? Um, no. She's gone full Zabka on us. Man, I can't be the Zabka. I I'm the sweet, lovable girl next door type. Evie is your girlfriend. You said you were going to break up with her, but you didn't. I thought being with you was the only thing that mattered, but now I'm not so sure. We're supposed to be together. Not this way. We don't want to start a relationship by hurting someone else. It's Erica. I can't have a good time knowing my best friend is staying home all by herself. You're taking my sister to prom. I'd love to go to prom with Erica, but our timing's always been wrong. It's just not meant to be. Erica Goldberg, will you go to prom? It just isn't meant to be. Great news. Don't even say it. We are the worst. Erica Goldberg, will you go to prom with me? The universe doesn't want us to be together. I know, but then I think about the most important night of the year, and there's only one person I want to spend it with. You. What if there was a way that we could keep our dates, but still go together? And how would we do that? Double date. Time after time. Screw it.